Have you heard about Alibaba's latest AI development, the Quen 2.5 Max? What sets this model apart from others? And could this be the next big thing in AI? Also, with China's rapid release of advanced models, should there be a slowdown in this tech race? It's remarkable how Chinese firms like DeepSeek are pushing the boundaries of AI with limited resources, operating with only 200 employees and a budget under $6 million. Today, we're exploring Alibaba's latest innovation, the Quen 2.5 Max model. This advanced model has been trained on over 20 trillion tokens and integrates sophisticated techniques such as supervised fine-tuning and reinforcement learning from human feedback. While it's a large-scale model, specifics about its parameters remain undisclosed. Additionally, unlike previous Chinese AI models, Quen 2.5 Max is not open source, with no current plans for it to be released as such. You can access and start using Quen 2.5 Max through Alibaba Cloud's API or via the Quen chat interface, diving into its capabilities and benchmark performances that set it apart in the AI landscape. Quen 2.5 Max is a sophisticated large-scale mixture of experts model, rigorously trained using over 20 trillion tokens. This model employs cutting-edge techniques such as supervised fine-tuning, SFT, and reinforcement learning from human feedback, RF, showcasing its capacity to adapt and learn from varied data inputs effectively. Although it is confirmed as a large-scale endeavor, the specific details regarding the number of parameters and the overall size of Quen 2.5 Max remain undisclosed, adding an element of mystery to its capabilities. Distinctively, Quen 2.5 Max differs from some prior AI models developed by Chinese companies in that it is not open source, and there is currently no indication that it will be made open source in the foreseeable future. This might impact its accessibility and usability among the broader developer community who rely on open source models for experimentation and development. For those eager to utilize Quen 2.5 Max, it is readily accessible through two main avenues, the Quen Chat interface and the Alibaba Cloud API. The Quen Chat offers a direct way to interact with the model in real time, making it suitable for those looking to integrate AI capabilities quickly and efficiently into their applications or services. Alternatively, the Alibaba Cloud API provides a more robust integration path for enterprises or developers needing a scalable solution for larger projects. To begin using Quen 2.5 Max via the API, interested users need to set up an account with Alibaba Cloud, sign up for the platform, and follow the step-by-step -step guide provided. This process ensures that users can maximize the model's potential and leverage its advanced AI capabilities for their specific needs. Whether for analyzing large datasets, enhancing customer interaction tools, or developing new AI-driven products, Quen 2.5 Max offers a powerful resource for a wide array of applications. Now, let's talk about how Quen 2.5 Max stacks up against other models. Unlike the DeepSeek R1, which is a reasoning model, Quen 2.5 Max is more like a standard model similar to DeepSeek V3. In this blog post, the team has shared several benchmark results from tests like Arena, MLU Pro, GPQ, Diamond Live Codebench, and Live Bench Test. They compared Quen 2.5 Max with other models like Deep V3, Llama 3.1, which has 405 billion parameters, GPT-40, and CLA 3.5 Sonnet. From the charts, you can see that Quen 2.5 Max comes out on top. In these benchmark tests shown here, Quen 2.5 Max also compared its base model with other open source models, including Quen 2.5 with 72 billion parameters, DeepSeek Phi 3, and Llama 3.1 with 405 billion parameters. The benchmark results are impressive, with Quen 2.5 Max outperforming all these models. If you're interested in trying out the Quen 2.5 Max model, you can head over to the chat interface and start using it to generate images or utilize the large language model, LLM. If you prefer using the API, you can access it through the Alibaba Cloud API platform. To get started, Simply go to the Quen Chat interface at chat.quenlm.com, sign up for a new account, and at the top, you'll find an option to select the model. Just set it to Quen 2.5 Max, 
the most powerful language model in the Quen series. I've set it up, and you can start using it right away to ask questions, generate images, and more. Quen 2.5 Max also features something called artifacts, similar to what we've seen in CLO. This allows you to ask questions, and the AI will render the output in a separate tab. For example, if you want to preview HTML or SVG, the Artifacts option in Quen will let you do that. To test this model, I'll ask it to create a landing page for a web development agency named Astrotech. Here's the prompt I'll give, and I'll also enable the Artifacts option to see the actual preview of the code it generates. Then, I'll click on the Send button, and Quen 2.5 Max will start writing the code in HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Let's see how it does. Once the coding process is completed, you can view the generated code on the left side and a live preview of your page in the artifact section on the right. Let's wait for it to finish coding. All right, the AI has generated a simple landing page in HTML and CSS. It's straightforward, nothing too fancy. Now, let's say I want to add a hover animation to the cards under the Our Services section. I'll go ahead and instruct the AI to add a hover animation to these cards and see if it can execute this request. We'll wait a moment, and it looks like it has updated the code successfully. Now, when I hover over the cards, there's a nice lifting animation effect, which adds a dynamic touch to the page. Additionally, you can also upload images and photos. If you start a new chat, you'll find options for image generation and video generation, expanding the possibilities of what you can create with this AI. When I clicked on the image generation option and prompted the Quen 2.5 Max model, to generate an image of a bird flying in Times Square, New York, it handled the task surprisingly fast. The result is actually quite impressive, especially considering this is a free AI tool. It produced a nice, high-quality image which demonstrates the model's capabilities in image generation. Additionally, there's a video generation feature available in Quen 2.5 Max. Initially, I encountered some issues with it. For instance, when I tried to generate a video of a cat, it gave me an error, suggesting there might have been a bug. However, it seems to be resolved now because, after trying again, it's working smoothly. The video it generated looks reasonably good for a free AI model, which is quite promising for users who need to create multimedia content on the fly. That wraps up our deep dive into Alibaba's Quen 2.5 Max, the latest AI sensation from China. We've seen how this large-scale model performs across various benchmarks and explored its unique features, like image and video generation. The ability of Quen 2.5 Max to create high-quality visuals and manage complex tasks quickly is a testament to the advancements in AI technology, especially coming from Chinese tech giants. If you're curious about experiencing this technology firsthand, why not give it a try? You can access Quen 2.5 Max by following the first link in the description below. Sign up, explore its capabilities, and see how it can enhance your projects. What do you think about the pace of AI development and its implications for tech industries worldwide? Could this model be the key to solving problems you face in your work or creativity? Drop your thoughts and questions in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe for more insightful tech reviews and updates. Catch you in the next video where we'll explore even more groundbreaking technology.